Hello IT pros and welcome back to my IT workshop. So in this video uh, we are going to replace the optical drive, the CD DVD reader for an HP laptop, the one you're seeing right there. I've done uh, a similar video in the past, uh, one, two weeks ago, for a Dell, Dell laptop. I did the same, replace the optical drive for that. If you want to watch that video you can do it by clicking in the top right of this screen. Now let's go back to this video. We, uh, here is the HP. We're going to turn it. We're, I'm going to open it so you can see what the model is. This one is uh, HP ProBook 4540S, and we're we're going to replace. I'm, I'm going to show you how to replace the optical drive. So we're going to turn it over. As you can see here, uh, it's different from the Dell one. You, we have to remove the entire case to get access to the hard drive to all that. So as you can see, I'm not wearing jewelry or any watch. So, and get rid of the static electricity as well to avoid damaging your computer. So I'm going to remove the, the battery, something I didn't do in the last video. And on the top left, you can see there is where normally the warranty in years and the serial number for the HP laptops are located. Now we have to remove the almost, well, it's kind of the entire case the back case in this model. So the way you have to do it is um, you have these two clips on either uh, on the right and one on the left and you have to put them together. So the, it's the same way you, you remove the battery. But now I'm struggling <laughs> as always when working with computers and now I, I got it right. So I remove it, you can see here the hard drive, you can see the RAM, you can see, well, actually you cannot see it, but under that, that cover is the fan for the processor. So on the left is the hard drive. So you, we, uh, I'm pointing here a screw, you have to remove that. And below that is kind of a clip that we're going to use later to help us remove the optical drive. So using my screwdriver can be a Phillips, can be a plain one. In, in this case, it's a plain one. I'm going to remove it. So very easily, we're going to remove it there. And you see, well, my, my, my fingers are too thick to get inside that hole, but you see in my screwdriver, I'm going to push it to the left. And like that, that is that simple. So now we can remove the, the optical hard drive, the optical drive. So as you can see here, here's the model. I'm going to leave the link in the description below if you're interested. It's an affiliate link for, affiliate link for Amazon. And this uh, model was manufactured before 20, 2014. So it's a long time, more than six years or six years. So the, once you have the replacement, uh, as I mentioned, this computer is not, uh, it's working just fine. You just put it back. Once you put it back, you have to, we are going to put back the screw just like that very easily. So in this case, it's only one screw. In the Dell one, we have to remove two. So this, this way is easier. In this model is easier to do it. So we put back the battery and we are going to put back the case. Well, not the case, I mean this, this cover for the back part of the laptop. So that's what I wanted to show you in this short video, guys. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, please leave a like and subscribe. If you have any other com comments or questions, leave it in the comment section below. And as always, as you know, I'll see you in the next video.